Shout Factory TV, changing the channel. It wasn't designed for Kathy. It was, um, she came in uh, towards the end of the casting and we hadn't really found anybody yet that, would, that worked really well. What I liked about Kathy was once she was physically, I mean, she was a big girl. I mean, she, so she, I thought that that fit what we wanted to try to do and to establish some different physicality differences between people on the surface of the earth and people who had to live you know, closer to the center of the earth where the gravity would be much more intense and probably stunt their growth a little bit. So that was kind of the, the when I saw Kathy and she came in for her audition, that's what I realized right away that she was kind of the perfect choice because uh, I think she came in in a big fur coat too. And so she was, she just filled the whole room because she was tall and, and, and uh, statuesque. That was also the era where hair was, bigger and so it really it it really fit the image that I had uh, thematically for the for the movie when we auditioned her and had her read she, this voice came out of her that was kind of shocking at it I it was a very high-pitched sort of little girl's voice and I thought that worked also because of the idea of, the, of being basically being an adult trapped in a child's body um, which I wanted to explore in the movie.